I am inside the cistern. This is what the cistern is. All the steel bar, almost up. These guys really working fast, man. I'm surprised. Very impressed. I can't believe there's water coming straight out of the ground. Where the water supposed to be? Up on the hill. Ain't coming on top of the button and coming straight from under the rock. And there's a lot of water running onto the road, so this is like a, a dry gut or something, but it coming straight from the rock. A steady flow. A waterfall, I should say. Look at this. This is the rock. This is water coming off my foundation. Right? All the water here coming out. My brother is sure where coming through the wall, the hillside. This is a run down from that. From that on the ground blood. Which is kind of strange. I have never seen anything like that before. This is a lot of water. So we had a plan for it in the construction. Zero all water from behind the wall. Water on this side of the building, and we know now why there's water. I know we're here four months ago. And I was cutting the grass. I'm like, there's water here. Where does water come from? So we know the water is coming from in the middle of the foundation truck, a vein through the rocks. Um, I guess it's some kind of historical or some kind of past feature that was there for years that they running water on the ground. So I know now why this water is here. So um, we're casting them on there. We gotta find some way. Maybe by Monday be dry out, but. This spot here, I know for a fact, we were here last time. This solid rock under this area here, so that's why it's not, it's not draining like it's supposed to. But we're gonna plan to get rid of this water by getting gravel and the pipes and stuff to bring out the water. But at the same time, we're gonna capture it in a way to save it too. So there's a lot of water that comes out of that hill, like it's like three gallons per minute at least. All fast flowing, so we can't I leave things the way it is right now. With water under the foundation, it's gonna create more problems at the end of the day. But yeah, this is why the water is here from that from that hole coming through the rock with um uh, with water. Okay, this area here will be the stairway to go upstairs to the ground floor. And it's gonna always it's gonna always be as well the pump room. We made some changes to the flat. Originally the pump room was gonna be in here with the office, but we decided to put it over here. And we put in a half bathroom in here uh, with the office because there wasn't any none. Um, in the design and I realized that after the fact so the plumber was here yesterday and he went ahead and run some of the pipes and stuff before the cast on Monday this is for the sink and stuff but it's not gonna stay here it's gonna 
on it or something like that. I don't know what they're doing, but the bathroom is back there. And this is the office space here up in front. So that's one of the changes we make. Yesterday, all the braces has been done yesterday uh, for getting ready to cast on Monday for all the photos. So another thing that after we found the water coming through the wall, right, uh, when it rains and stuff, what I'm gonna do, we wanna capture that water, even though we wanna get, get the drains and stuff placed behind the wall. The plan is to capture the water still, uh, let it run through the building, come out, out in the front, and I'm gonna put together some kind of storage system up front behind the wall to store this water. For the water, there's a lot of water that comes out up the hillside through our vein in the rock. So it's like a steady flow, so we could use that water later on for something else. So the plumber came, set up the pipes, all that stuff to run under the building and everything so we can capture it later on uh, after we don't do the build. So oh, the, the one bare room on the basement floor starts from here. This is the wall, the main wall here. And it goes over to the end of the building. Now on paper, this looks pretty small. I didn't realize how big it is until you actually see it. So like here, it's a stairway to go upstairs to the, first, to the ground floor. Right, this is a stairway here and this is system right here. So this is a one bare room open floor plan so all here is the living room kitchen slash dining room or whatever this area here and then there's a wall here and there's a you can so a door that can go to the back way and hit to the bathroom in the back and here's the bedroom the bedroom is a good size bedroom you know so here's the bedroom here and then there's a window here and there's a window on the other side here and in the back over there um is the bathroom so your guests can walk from the living room or on the corner here and use the bathroom um, as intended to. So here's a bedroom here. So, so it's a good size be one bear bedroom. I didn't realize how large it was until you actually see it in person. But hey, until you build it, you will never know how big it is until you build it. But yeah, it's pretty big. All the bracing has been done on all the farm work. So like here, you know, this one here I feel a little shaky. Maybe they leave it like this for a reason, I don't know. But yeah, all the bracing has been put in place to support the farm. And I think they spent majority of yesterday just bracing the farms. And as you can see, all the way down this bracing on all the farm work. Even on the inside, they put like a steel on the back. And they put like this, um, this um, um, lumber to tie it in. So. Um, yeah, I think where the area have a lot of pressure, like here, they put a lot of bracing all the way down. It's bracing all the way down on this side. So my only concern with this one bedroom bathroom, this bathroom here, is a long way from the septic tank. The septic tank is all the way down where you see those blocks is there. At the end on there, that's where the septic tank is going to be. So I'm going to have to put an additional pump to pump the crap from the bathroom down to the septic tank which will be way down there and I didn't realize that because we can't put a tank septic tank over here because it's close to the boundary it's not allowed to be closed so the only option is once the pour on Monday the plumber comes in run his pipes while the, the trench is still dug out and put in the pipe before they stack up the hole so you have a small window to get this done because Tuesday morning they will remove this farm so hopefully he shows up and do his job but yeah it's a long way this this whole building is like 80 feet long <coughs> so it's a long way plus another maybe 15 feet to get to the septic tank um once you do a flush over here so this is a very long flush and I wasn't a flush this long in my life but I think we can make it work We're in 2024 so we have the technology to accommodate any kind of stuff like this. Praise for family, fans and friends. Father, I ask that you guide and protect our going out and our coming in. I give thanks in your name I pray. Amen. Some people don't see the next day. You should give thanks for what you have. Some don't have a baby. Thanks for the little that you got.
I give praise. Give thanks and praise. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment if you want to say something that's on your mind. I don't mind feedback, so leave a comment and let me know what you think about the video. My inspection done by the government.
it up, I shake it up for oh, you like that, yeah. And when you bend it up, you bend it up, you bend it up, you bend it up, I like that, yeah. And when you give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, baby, I like that, yeah. And when you give me all of that, when you put it on this spot, I like that. You have me singing. time please make sure to like share and subscribe if you like my videos hey it helps introduce more people to the video so please like and share all right thank you cool castles
to soak her Cut a vibe where you're on the way so, uh, And if you're on that, stay far from me Cause we don't like that, stay far from me Your vibe's heavy and I want it all for me Where you are from me You see once my head done nice I don't care what you're talking about Take a shot and wash your mouth Only one set of negative thing coming out Take a shot and wash your mouth It's good vibes, good people Like what we on there, no evil Don't forget what the elders teach you And the teacher That if you have nothing good to say Don't say nothing at all Just Hey YouTube, don't forget to like and subscribe And I'll see you in the next video